Hi, you guys, and welcome to Tanya Memmi Home. I'm Tanya Memmi, and if you haven't seen me on the A&E Network or the FYI channel on Smart Home Nation or Sell This House, you'll see me here on Tanya Memmi Home doing product reviews because I love everything home, especially products for the home, and I love reviewing products that I actually enjoy and ones that I use. So this is something that I've been using for the past month. Um, this is really, it's, it's an awesome espresso machine. It is a steam frother. It also makes the perfect temperature for your espresso drinks. And it has a 15 bar professional pump, which is very cool. So you get that professional taste. And even though it tastes professional and looks professional, it's very, very easy to use for that beginner espresso maker as well. So right from the beginning, the get-go, when you take it out of the box, it's just an amazing gift that you feel like you're receiving, a gift that you could be giving to someone. But right away, let's get into looking at some of the features of this product. I love how it's so streamlined the way that it is here. And here we have the retractable water tank right here. You can easily just fill it up and then click it back in. You have, you can lift up the lid right here just to fill it in, or you can take it off and walk away, fill it up, and then put it back onto the machine. And I love the fact that it doesn't have many buttons, so it's not so confusing. You have your on and off button, you have your single espresso cup, your double espresso cup, and then you have your steam frothing button. Take your favorite coffee, and I love this, it's your measuring tool right here, and you just take your, it, it kind of measures out the perfect amount of coffee, no matter what kind of coffee you use. You definitely want to use coffee that's already ground because it's already sort of, uh, you don't want to get something that's ground too finely either. And uh, because it kind of, it can be a little bit difficult on the machine or hard on the machine. And then you just press it in with this side of the tool, just like that. And then you easily just put it in like that. And you want to make sure it's nice and tight like that so that it doesn't fall out. So make sure you feel that click when you're putting it in. Make sure that the machine is warmed up. My machine is warmed up and ready to go and we're gonna make the perfect espresso right now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make two cups of espresso instead of one because I like my coffee a little bit strong. I'm a little bit of a coffee connoisseur. And with this machine, you can make all kinds of different espresso drinks, whether it's a cappuccino, or a flat white, or just a cup of, of uh, espresso, whatever you want, any any espresso drink you can make with this machine. So again, I'm gonna do the, the double espresso right here. Now let's see how I did. Give it a couple seconds here. <clears throat> and this is looking great. The color's looking really good. I like how it's a little bit frothy on the top. This is looking really, really good. And it's nice and dark and rich. And this is because it's a great machine. And again, it's perfect for beginners. It's not intimidating at all. It doesn't have too many buttons. It's not difficult to use at all. Easy to clean. There's little to no setup. You just take it out of the box, plug it in, put some water in it, wash it out before you start using it, and uh, just plug it in, put some water in it, and it's ready to go. So here is my espresso. Look how good that looks. Now I'm gonna get my milk. I'm gonna froth my milk and I'm gonna show you how easy it is. So this is non-fat milk. You can use any kind of milk you want. We're gonna pull out the frothing wand. See how easy it is to pull it out? You put the tip of the frothing wand in, you turn on the button. All it is, just a press of a button, just like that. And then you take your knob and you press it down to get it going. And you can push it all the way down, but kind of like feel where you want it. You don't have to push it all the way down, maybe halfway. You don't want to boil your milk. So you want to let up on it so that it doesn't boil. But you want to get it frothing. And you want to have it in not so far so that it can grab some air too, because it takes the air and mixes it in with the milk. There it goes. You can kind of see it raising in the in the cup. Who doesn't love froth milk? I love froth milk. Oh, that sounds good. When you hear that sound, it means it's almost done. Perfect. Now we're gonna pour the milk into the espresso. This is my favorite part. Do you know how good this is gonna taste? Okay, if I had a little spoon, I would I would scoop out the rest of the froth. But that is the perfect 
latte. <laughs> Look how good that looks. Let's take a sip. That's really good. The perfect temperature. It's nice and warm. It's, it's, it's beautiful. Look at that froth. Love it. I love the machine. And the other thing I want to say is that the customer service that you get with this company is fabulous. There's wonderful people behind this company. I've had to send them a couple of emails because I just had a couple questions. They got back to me right away. They're super friendly. They're super involved with their customers. And um, it's just overall, it's a great company. It's a, it's a feel good product. Happy shopping.